Hey guys, Victor Brian here from Napster Films and today guys I'm going to be showing you something called an underlay. So we're going to check the difference between an underlay and a group. So what is an underlay? An underlay is something that groups things together inside Fusion. But the difference, the main difference between the underlay and a group is, is that in an underlay you can see what is in the group and in the group you can't see what is in the group until you double click the grouping so let me just jump in here and show you the difference so i'm going to select everything that is here to this point and i'm going to press shift and space bar and i'm going to type in here under and right away you can see there is something that is the tool that is selected is called underlay and i'm going to press enter to add and right away you can see this is a group you see i can move this around and i can see what is inside the grouping so with an underlay you can even change the color for me my best color is teal so i'm going to use the teal so you can you can use color to differentiate what what underlay you're going to use and you can also change the name of the underlay so you can press f2 and change let's say let's call this teal teal underlay and press enter so you see the name just changed and let's just use a group for a second so we're going to i'm going to right click and select everything that is here and i'm going to press ctrl g and right away you can see this is the group so i can press f2 to rename the group i can just call it the same thing group one but to be able to see i can't tell what is inside the group so to be able to see i just have to double click and see what is inside the group so this is the main difference between the group and an underlay an underlay you can see what is inside and you can move it around even in the group you can move what is around but to be able to see what is inside you have to double click so that's it for today guys this is the main difference between uh, using an underlay and a group so you, you choose for yourself what works for you best but for me underlays work for me best because i can see what i'm doing and i can separate what i'm doing using colors so this is a is something that works for me and guys this is what we are going to check out this week so see you next week and i'll come up with another tutorial 